Hey guys, uh, I'm going to show you uh, what's an easy way to determine, you know, positions uh, for pop, pop displays, custom positions. Um, so what you want to do is, here's my back glass, it's 1920 by 1080. Uh, you can do this in any editor, but I'm doing this in uh, paint.net, which is free. Uh, what I do is I resize, and I make sure you don't maintain aspect ratio. And I set it to 1000 and by 1000, okay? Now you look like, whoa, that's out of whack, but that's okay. You want it out of whack, but we, even though it's out of whack, when I do my selection box, and how do I, if I do my selection box, I'm gonna click right there. Of course, you'd be more accurate by looking afterwards, but we wanna go right there, okay? So that's our selection box. Now, because we did a thousand by a thousand, you'll notice here, it has all the numbers for you right here. You just divide it by 10 and you have all the numbers. So if you see here, selection top is 225, 453. That's percentage wise because we did 1,000, it's 22.5 and 45.3. Size is 55.1 and 47.9. So that's your custom position. Your custom position would be on back glass. And like I said there, 22.5 because it's 225, 45.3. And you got width 55.1 because it's 551 and 54.7. That's how you would get your quick and easy way of getting. Now, if you were doing um, other things you want to know, location, say you want to put a font here, a size here. So wherever you're selecting, um, you just got to, you just, you know, say you want font here. You, you see with the top left to be 39.2 and 18.5. Again, that's because we did it 1000 by 1000. So when you're working with it, you just got to work with this so you can grab all your numbers and you're all done. Alrighty. Cheers.